He played 14 minutes in this national semifinal match, none bigger than the 67th. Foster McCune giving Georgetown the insurance goal in their 2 0 win over Stanford to advance the national title match. We're joined by Foster now. What are you thinking in that moment as you make it 2 0 and secure this win? I just said it upstairs. Doesn't have to be pretty. Uh, goal's a goal. So anything to push us through to Sunday, and we're going to keep rolling, that's for sure. Everyone in that locker room is ready to go. I can tell you that. You obviously have a vision for how this type of the game is going to go, and you just beat a team in Stanford that's won three of the last four national championships. How did this performance compare to your vision? Everyone was ready to go coming into this game. Um, obviously, the conditions weren't optimal, but it didn't make it any different for us in the end. We got an early goal, and we still found a way to dictate that game. So uh, it'll do. It wasn't the prettiest, but once again, it doesn't matter. We're playing on Sunday. What was pretty? was Sean Zawatsky in the fourth minute, an absolute sure. bullet from 22 yeah. yards out. What are you thinking as you're watching that bullet crack through the net? I mean, I didn't even see it hit the net. I knew it was going in the second he hit that thing, so I'm up off the bench. We're all flying. That thing, I don't know how he does that, but we'll take it. <laughs> how does this team keep doing it? Time and again, you're outdoing yourself, and in this NCAA tournament now, you've outscored teams 14-2. to two. That's just uh, our depth. We got so many weapons. We can score in so many ways. And you saw that today. We scored two very different goals. We might score in a different way on Sunday. It doesn't matter. We're joined by the man of the match in this national semifinal. A goal, his third of the year, coming just four minutes in. And then his first assist of the season to put this one on ice. It's a sophomore, Sean Zawatsky of the Georgetown Hoyas. Sean? What is going through your mind as that ball is flaring up into the air just outside the 18 and you approach it? Uh, to be honest, the shot was the last thing on my mind. Uh, I was looking to pass to Nealis. Ball came down to my liking and, you know, just, just hit it. And just went in the goal. I mean, we're talking about hitting it on frame at the beginning. Uh, we were doing shooting practice before the game, and that's what I tried to do, and it eventually went in. How much do you try a shot like that out? Not very often, you know. Uh, did a little bit last year. We had our like coach gives us five minutes of fiddle time, down of practice sometimes. So just toss us balls and we'll just try and hit them off the volley and all that. And haven't done it yet this year. So I guess I don't really need to anymore. In a college cup match, there's so much intensity going into it, and it comes against a Stanford program that's been a dynasty. When you hit that goal through, how much did it change this group mentally? Uh, we were ready from the get-go, but once it went in, we were, we knew we were, we were good. We, we've defensively we've been stout all year, and uh, we knew we get a goal, we'll be in a good spot. You know, then we came in at halftime, we're looking for another one. The second one would have put this team away, and we did. Today it was different guys stepping up, and you know, just went our way. How rewarding is it to know that you're 90 minutes away from a national championship? Incredible. It's still going through my mind, still processing everything, and just a dream come true.